I have had the privilege of leading a new members class. This has been a blessing to me because I am one of the first people who get to meet those who have chosen our church. And as part of that, I portray Susanna Wesley. It was her philosophy that a child should learn to pray as soon as they learn to talk. John seems to have been the child who took to her methodical ways of life the most, and from that, he became the first Methodist. I believe that Susanna Wesley is a perfect example of someone who discipled those who were closest to her. She is a role model for all of us. Amen. And as you are being seated, we invite the children to come for a very special lesson. Ministering to the children is one of the most important ministries of our church because it's very important that we let them know that we love them, that God loves them, and that they can share that love with others too. They will always be able to come back to that and remember what they've learned and what they've built their faith on. I feel like discipleship is telling about God's Word, but it also involves actions doing for others and, and just spreading God's love because that's what he charged us to do. Come on, watch your step coming through. Oh good, I've got big kids too, they can help me. This is good. Big kids. Big kids can help me. I go with a philosophy that um, how you do things can change someone else's life and so it's important to bring that forward. I mean, I, I don't do any overt things, I don't think, uh, about discipleship and telling people about it. We could share our stories and we could see how faith helped them, how they drew their strength from their faith. It just turned out so well. What made you decide to go do your devotional, not in your room, but with others? It could have been a calling, because the aides used to do them, yeah. but they needed someone to do devotions Monday through Friday, so. You know, I like doing the devotions, and it's really, really interesting. I hope that they get the best out of it. I hope that they get everything that they want. My prayer for the church is that it's a wonderful church and um, we would like more people to add to our congregation. A lot more people. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen.